Hey boys and girls, welcome back to another episode of Story Time. Anyway, let's start where we left off on page four. Maybe a little more. What are we starting about anyway? The day after he'd made that stupid promise, Alien Slayer colon three dash capital D exclamation point comma the greatest video game in the history of video games arrived in stores. As 3D had motion sensor technology and a built-in projection unit that made the game look, feel, and sound like the actual invading aliens were in the room, room with you. That sounds more like 50th century technology. Wouldn't you agree, Jenkins? I don't know who Jenkins is. It came with two shiny silver zip-up motion sensor bodysuits. Like aluminum foil. Also, you can play with a friend. And a choice of motion synchronized weapons. They're using a lot of supposedly big words that are actually quite simple. Pfft, way to make them sound smart and failing at it. A turbo stack. Sounds like a plunger. A blaster shield. I'm not sure what that would be. Like a frying pan or something. Or a peg, pair of mega mittens. Giant kitties. You know, a common name for cats is... Mittens or snowball. Anyway, as you stood in front of the game, Ash 3D sends your every move in the suit and with the weapons, allowing you to realistically bow, battle the aliens. Every detail of the game was designed for a lifelike experience. As soon as you powered it up, Whatever you were watching on TV cartoons, dancing with America's most talented pets. Your dad's bearing boring news show, which only go all fuzzy, and suddenly you'd be face to face with Lad Dash Row, e evil alien overlord, little R symbol thing that show that you can't copy the name. Who would want to copy that? It's a pretty crappy name. But seriously, that's kind of stupid. Like. That is absolutely no respect to other people's stuff. Not sure if that would go over very well with people who would announce, People of Earth, we interrupt your mindless entertainment programming to inform you that your planet is about to be invaded, dash dash dash, by aliens. Then the holographic creatures would begin leaping out of your TV and start blasting away at you on your sofa. So it would shoot light onto nothing. It would shoot light on the couch. That's like shooting a cat out of a barrel. Everybody knows cats are immune to barrels. With this game, Alex. I was wondering when we were going to hear his name again. I forgot what his name was. Could have survived a hundred boring Merwinsville summers, but he had made a promise. And his dad always... I think I missed a page. Uh, said, a promise is a promise, although if Alex never really understood why. Yeah, I know, it's just the same words twice. A porcupine is a porcupine, too, but people don't go around saying that. I'm liking that. A porcupine is a porcupine. What people say, a promise is a promise. Yes! A porcupine is a porcupine. No. As Alex stood and thought about all this stuff, his parents stood over him, grinning anxiously, Alex looked at the TV, closed his eyes, and pulled the trigger. The very last alien invader squealed and exploded. Exploded. He was a good man. I never really knew him personally, but he seemed like a good man. His mom and dad cheered and high-fived each other. Oh yeah. Hammer time. Alex sighed and heard what he'd been dreading for weeks. Congratulations, Earthling. You slayed the alien invaders, saved your planet, and successfully completed Alien Slayer 2. Watch for Alien Slayer, alien Slayer 3D, available in stores this summer. Well, what if you get the game a few years later? Well, did it be in stores already? Gee, thanks, Alex mumbled. No, 